Now tonight, a developing investigation along I-70 near Colfax. Highway planners may look into making a stretch of this road safer after a driver slammed into a semi and died early this morning. Police believe that driver was going the wrong way on I-70. And this is the second deadly accident along that same stretch of highway since December. Denver 7's Thomas Hoppo reports tonight. If I can make an impact and make a legacy out of my sister, that's what I want to do. Early this morning on I-70 near Colfax, a crash where E-470 intersects with I-70. A driver died when their sedan crashed into a semi-truck. Colorado State Patrol says it was a head-on crash, but cannot confirm whether a driver was going the wrong way on I-70. The crash appears to be similar to one that happened on Christmas Day. An elderly couple appeared to be going the wrong way on I-70 and crashed into another couple. Three people died. You know, I want some kind of change on that highway. Joshua Paul's sister Katie died in that crash on Christmas Day. She was hit by the drivers driving the wrong way going off of E-470 to I-70. And Paul wants improvements to that area both of these crashes happened on to make it safer. There's a lot of road signs on that highway that say no left turn or wrong way, but the placement is in hard places to see and it's poorly lit. Um, that off ramp has, has minimal lighting. There's no flashing lights. There's nothing. CDOT says it doesn't study every crash or accident, but did say they may look into what went wrong on Christmas Day. We wanted to know how many wrong way crashes have happened there recently, but haven't heard back. Because I want to save at least one person in the future. Thomas Hoppo, Denver 7.